comparing Pierre Polyev and uh, comparing him to Donald Trump, of course, because that's their new gimmick. Uh, so let's just have a look at this, and then we'll uh, talk about it a little bit after. Common sense of the common people. Common sense. Common sense plan. An old-fashioned American common sense. Common sense conservative prime minister. Conservative person with common sense. Common sense. You know, we're really the party of common sense. Using a common sense law. Common sense, right? Common sense. The Republican Party really is the party of common sense. Common sense. The party of common sense. It's a common sense step. Common sense is common sense, and that's what we need. It's common sense. The thing called see what I mean? How like, You must be so desperate to think that this is going to work somehow as your, oh, Pierre Polyev is just like Donald Trump. It's like, really? Because I've never heard Pierre Polyev talk about building a wall or leaving marijuana laws up to the province. And no, he's not going to touch any abortion laws. So where's the comparisons here in terms of policy? Well, they're both conservative. Yeah, that doesn't mean that they're the same person. I mean, you have to be, you must be getting beat really badly in the polls to actually think this. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, they're still losing by 20 points. That's maybe that's why they're doing this. Right. I mean, I mean, they're just they're so out of touch and just completely out of their mind that they, they just think that, oh, well, this will help people turn uh, people against Pierre Polyev. It's like, no, it's not. Why would you even think it would? I mean, this is just insane. It's just <laughs> It's wild, guys. And then there's also another video too. Uh, it's having a hard. I'm having a hard time loading it for some reason. But there's another video as well of uh, Mick Jagger in a concert, and uh, he asked. He, he said something nice about Justin Trudeau. I didn't understand exactly what he said, but he goes on to say, you know, oh, how about that uh, Justin Trudeau? And everyone just goes boo. It's just like a massive, massive boo, right? It was. It's just. It's pretty crazy like it, people are just uh people really think that this kind of stuff's gonna work sorry my video is being really weird today okay we'll just turn that down then i'm gonna finish up here but yeah mick jagger was kind of you know you know saying something nice and then he just they just absolutely destroyed justin trudeau and just kept booing the absolute crap out of him in vancouver so that's the liberal, that's the people's response to liberal propaganda. And that's what's going to keep happening as well, right? I mean, you're, it's not going to, it's not going to slow down. It's not going to, they're not going to all of a sudden wake up one day and actually have some common sense. They're going to keep smearing Pierre Polyev in whatever, whichever petty and stupid ways that they possibly can. So yeah, sorry about that guy. My, my video system is being really uh, laggy and weird today, but yeah, either way. Uh, let me know what you think. Do you think that this kind of weird smear campaign propaganda is going to work? Or do you think that Canadians actually have some common sense and understand that we need Justin Trudeau out of here so that some of our issues, mainly financially, can get fixed because we're not headed towards a good area? So again, I always love hearing what you guys have to say. Um, definitely let me know what you think in the comments section. And please don't forget to like and subscribe as it really helps join the uh, really helps me grow this channel. Thanks again so much for watching. and I'll be back shortly with another video.